Alright y'all, we're on to something huge. No idea what it is, I'm thinking it's a treasure chest. Let's keep going. It's a penis shell. <laughs> Here it is y'all, part of this exposed. What do y'all think it is? Oh my gosh, look I can put my finger through it. Look at this thing dude, so exciting. What do y'all think it is? Do you think it's an old Spanish cannon from a shipwreck? It's gotta be at least two and a half, three feet deep. We had to wait till the tide was super low to get in here. <laughs> it's a shovel, y'all. <laughs> it's a gold shovel. It's a leprechaun's really big shovel. <laughs> That's cool. That's awesome. <laughs> That's 52, y'all. It looks like a, a handmade fishing weight. What the heck? That's pretty awesome. such in pristine condition. Is that like a part of a World War II engine? that one home with me. Maybe not the shovel. Mango jalapeno. Not like we say down in the south, say jalapeno. This is a jalapeno, eh? Margarita. Quieres? Venga conmigo. Vienes conmigo. Come on, let's go. <laughs> ¿Cómo están ustedes, mis amigos? Soy en las Bahamas ahorita y es muy linda, muy preciosa. La isla es muy hermosa. El mar es de más hermosa color azul. Y los pescados no mucho. Y las conchitas no mucho, pero la arena linda. <laughs> ¿Quieres una margarita? <laughs> Thank you. 
It's a tiny sand dollar. It's smaller than my thumbnail. Isn't it cute? It's so tiny. idea what it is y'all. I wish I could say it was something awesome like a piece of eight <laughs> but um, I don't know it looks like a weird scooby-doo mystery item. All right y'all who knows what it is HMU fish on it. That's awesome. It's like a penny. A tiny penny. Oh, it's a Bahama penny. So cute. Hey, Mon. <laughs> we found a penny, Mon. That's awesome. It's got a starfish and a flamingo on it. 76, y'all. It's out of the hole, y'all. Sometimes it's not exciting when it's out of the hole, but it's out of the hole. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's Shark Boy's Shark Fin. <laughs> it's like an old. It's a pirate beer can. <laughs> it's an old can. All crushed up. Part of my Bahamian collection. Put in my eye. <laughs> Alright y'all, we found something huge. No idea what it is. Here we go, you ready? Mark, get back. What is that? Look at it, it's got like screws. It's from the Titanic. Look, what the heck is that? Seriously, look at that. It's got like bolts in it. What the? It's a piece of a boat, right? It's Ooh. insanity. That's cool though. Should we leave it here or should we take it? Looks like bonkers. It's like a, it's like that thing that you unscrew and screw in a boat. <laughs> that lets the water out. A plugger? A drain plugger. No, I'm kidding. I have no idea what it is. That's really old. I'm definitely thinking it's from a pirate ship. I think it's like the equivalent of like a brake drum or some sort of a component to the inside of a boat or motor of a boat. I have no idea what I'm talking about, but also why would it be on the beach? All right, y'all. So we're going to go ahead and rebury this because it is like 25, 30 pounds and I don't have room in my suitcase. <laughs> so um, if y'all know, Please hit me up, comment, because I'm just interested to see what y'all think it is. But I'm going to go ahead and rebury it, because uh, it's so heavy. So we're here in NASA, Bahamas. Um, I've had a super great time. Got a couple of days of detecting in. Didn't find anything like super crazy. No pieces of eight. But it was still super fun. Um, bought a shovel. 
at a hardware store so that we could find um, what I thought was, and hoping overnight, a couple nights actually, um, waiting for the tide to get low. Uh, we bought a shovel to see if we could find out if what we thought was possibly a treasure chest. <laughs> no such luck. Um, we actually dug up a shovel, so. I didn't bring that upstairs. We actually went ahead and threw that away so that it would not be a safety hazard. We brought our little doodads that we got and um, surf was fine. Bahamas mon. <laughs> I've had such a great time here. It's super fun. So sad to leave, but um, gotta go back to reality. Found this little doodad um, at the Queen's Staircase, which is a part of Fort Fincastle, one of the forts that we visited here because it's totally industry. Um, found this on the ground. I have no idea what it is. It looks like one of the um, shipwrecked coins like that I've seen on the internet. Um, a little tiny one. Um, but anyways, if y'all know what it's from, if you think it's from like a bottle or something, some sort of replica, I'd love to hear um, it in the comments. So that was fun to find. And um, my other favorite thing was the little tiny sand dollar that I found. I uh, just found it on the bottom of the ocean floor while I was snorkeling along and uh, yeah, I'm probably going to make a new necklace because I'm a nerd. Because <laughs> it's so cute. found a couple awesome pieces of pottery actually, which is like so super cool. Um, while snorkeling, um, this guy and this guy and this little looks like a piece of a tile or something. Like a terracotta tile. Uh, found some money. Found a couple pennies, Bahamian pe pennies and um, a Bahamian quarter, which is kind of awesome because it looks like the American quarter from the side and the shape and the color and all that, um, the size. But um, it's kind of awesome. It has a sailboat on one side and then the uh, swordfish and flamingo on the other, which is the uh, country's bird, right? So cool. Other service signs we got were, um, while snorkeling, like a possible shark tooth. Uh, found like some sort of awesome piece of a can, um, I'm guessing, but I'm not really sure. Uh, whatever it is, it's super cool, I'm totally using it in my art. Um, as well as this, which is from a plane crash suitcase luggage, but <laughs> hopefully not. <laughs> And then of course we got bottle caps, um, which are really cool, super rusty and old looking. Looks like this one was a Budweiser. Um, got my shells and pieces of conch shell and little sort of clammy things that are so pretty in pink and yellow. Super awesome colors. Found a super awesomely gigantic sand dollar, so cool, very fragile. Um, found some glass, not exactly sea glass, doesn't have like the super rounded tips, but like the beginning stages. Um, some of them I actually threw away, so just cleaning up the environment, y'all. Always a good thing. Um, this was a bottle cap actually, um, from one of the pirate ships. I can tell because it's black. Because it's old. Because, you know, couldn't you see like the pirates like popping off like a beer cap with a beer up? No, no, bottle, no, no. My most favorite find. Um, is Pirate Pete's freaking whiskey bottle or whatever the heck this was. I guess it could be wrong. I'm not really sure. I'm not like a connoisseur of like uh, booze bottles, but it's definitely something cool. And it had like things growing out of it and it was awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, clean this up and use this as a flower vase because I am a nerd and it is a totally awesome piece. I think it's really cool. Very sentimental now because it's one of my uh, souvenirs and um, found it way out in the ocean where I was like, brave enough to like venture out on a kayak, so. <laughs> um, played with sea turtles, played with stingrays, played with fish, crabs, all sorts of uh, fun little marine life critters and uh, had a great time. Um, anyways, thanks for joining me y'all. I've had a ton of fun here in NASA Bahamas, plan on coming back super soon and um, thanks for watching.
SpongeBob SquarePants. Found a couple. Blah, blah, blah. Was wondering. Blah, 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 red leather, yellow leather. Was wondering. <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> Anyways. You gotta cover up your hole. Y'all gotta remember. You gotta cover up your hole. Some unsuspecting person might fall right in. Now when you have a hole, y'all, you better cut, best cover them up, because if you don't...